Oh, I lost connection. Okay. Hey, friends. Good evening. I can't believe we're already in August. This is nuts. Happy Monday. It's been a crazy Monday. It's been a busy Monday. Very, very busy. But I got a scentsy package in, and I know earlier I said go live, but I kept pushing it back. Just it's been crazy busy. So now that he's outside swimming, and yes, he has supervised by adults, so don't freak out. But um, I'm going to open the Lord of the Rings collection. So I have the warmer and the wax bar here, as well as I think I have a couple other waxes here as well. Super excited. I've been wanting to smell this fragrance all day long because I've heard so much good things about it. So this is going to be a fresh fragrance. I thought that they would make it more like woodsy earthy because, you know, Lord of the Rings, you think of like mountains and meadows and stuff. But let's smell it. Okay. So the scent description for this is the dawn of a new journey as a woodland breeze carries hints of fresh citrus forest florals over lush peaceful hillsides so this is what it looks like and just ignore the background i know i have tv on in the background but we're gonna focus on scentsy so this is what the bar looks like oh kind of got a glare from my computer it's really cool i love all the details this totally reminds me of the ring off of the movie like even the, the inscription so let's smell it if i can get it out I ended up getting two of these because I thought it was going to be super good according to like what everybody was saying. So I hope it's good. Oh, this is so good. Mmm. I definitely smell like the forest florals. I don't smell any of the citrus, but definitely like this is a forest fragrance. I'm really shocked that they put this in like a fresh category. I mean, I guess it's kind of fresh, but... It's not super strong. This is definitely like a woodsy fragrance. Oh, Sean's going to love this. I'm glad I got two. So, Sean, one's for you, one's for me. Um, But this is super good. I actually might put this in my club because it's really good. I wasn't I wasn't sure at first. When I read the description, I was kind of like, eh. But then everybody's like, oh, it's so good. So, you can get the Lord of the Rings wax. Still available now for $7. And then, ta-da! This is our warmer. Look at the box. Even the box has such great details. So this warmer is available for $80. They're all while supplies last. So get yours while you can because this was actually an incentive this month for us consultants where we had to sell three of these products, whether it was the waxes or the warmer. And if you did, you got part of our 20 year incentive. So I already passed that. So thank you to all my clients who helped me earn that. So let's open this bad boy up. So again, I did not think about plugging it in, which I swear I forget about doing that every time. I've got to get an extension cord. This is what the box inside looks like. Super cute. It says, in a hole in the ground there lived a hobbit. Now I was talking with a friend and a client earlier because she just got hers a couple days ago and she's, she loves it. But I totally agree with her. I think they should have put some of the main characters on the front of the warmer instead of putting all the characters on the back. <gasps> Look at the dish. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. It says the Lord of the Rings. And then I'm not sure what it says like on the inside, but it's like the same inscription as like what's on the ring in the movie. It's kind of hard to see. But how cool is that? I love the gold effect. That is so awesome. So that's what the wax would go in. And again, this is a full-size warmer, so you're probably looking at like two, well, probably three to four cubes. Depends on like how strong you want the wax to be. There's the light bulb. I love how everything comes packaged so nicely because you don't have to worry about things showing up broken. All right, how do you open this one? Okay. So I'm going to show you the back first because, like I said has all the main characters on the back and I wish that they would have put some on the front but there's our little logo so you got Gandalf oh gosh help me out guys what's his name I want to say Baggett but I'm probably so wrong um I'm not a super duper like Lord of the Rings fan but I do love Lord of the Rings I watched it as a kid with my dad but there's the other main guy I forget his name I want maybe Frodo is that his name I don't know one of the characters <laughs> 
Um, then it's got little signs like showing where to go. How cool is that? You really can't see all the detail, but these are hand painted. I watched a video of them making this. It's really cool. So let's slowly go around to the side. Look at the little window and all the details and the grass and the flowers. So this is supposed to be like the sh uh, the Shire house that's inside, you know, the um, the hillside. How freaking cute. It's got the little gate. Where's the gate? little gate with the walkway up to the door oh my goodness so when you turn this on this little part right here will shine a light through as well as all of the windows like I mean it's so cute when it's turned on but look at all the details oh my goodness so you'd screw the light bulb in let's see now again I don't have a cord to plug it into I didn't think about that. I don't think there's one up there I can plug in either. But I can at least show you what it looks like. And then I will do another video of it turned on. So what light bulb is this? This is a 20 watt. So this takes a 20 watt light bulb. So one of the kind of smaller ones. But you turn that, you plug that in, and then you put the wax dish in like that, and boom! That's the Lord of the Rings warmer. Oh my gosh, it is just to die for. I really thought this would sell out faster than it. I mean, it's still available. I'm shocked. I really thought it was going to sell out. But this is so cute. Oh my goodness, I have a couple people that were just like super obsessed when this came out and had to snag it. Let me close this box real quick. I'm working on limited space like my desk is a mess from trying to get Scentsy family reunion stuff out to other sisters orders are flying in and then with the baby stuff going on it's just it's been kind of crazy hopefully those flashing lights don't bug anyone but sneak peek you see that warmer right there that Mickey Mouse pumpkin is coming back in our harvest collection with a Scentsy buddy and it is so cute I'm snagging that Scentsy buddy I love the little pumpkin design and then if you haven't snagged our Monsters, Inc. one, the Monsters, Inc. collection is actually in clearance right now. They just put a ton of stuff in clearance and a ton of Disney stuff. I was like, I woke up the other day and I was like, oh my gosh, our clearance section just like, they bombarded it with a whole bunch of stuff. So that was our Lord of the Rings stuff. Now I do have two other wax bars here. Um, one I actually ordered for Melissa. So I'm going to actually have to message her and let her know this came in but this is a good one it's called jam and jubilee and it smells so good this was a scent of the month i want to believe last month it was scent of the month yeah last month and then this one was scent of the month this month which is providence lavender mm, this one smells so good it's super fresh if you really like lavender and fresh i definitely suggest putting this one in your scentsy club um, since the club is free to join, anything you put in your club that's non-consumable will be kept for you until it's, um, something is going on outside. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Um, so any wax that you put in your Scentsy club will be made for you for life, even if it's discontinued, not in season. So that's why I have my Scentsy club because I have a ton of waxes in there that I just can't live without. Like a lot of our bring back my bars or like for Ethan, he likes root beer. And that one only came out, I think couple months ago in our bring back my bars and as soon as I saw it I'm like it's going in my club for him but those were our waxes that we got and the Lord of the Rings collection again I mean this is so flipping cute I should have really tried to plug it in before going live but look at this I mean every Lord of the Rings fan nerd are gonna go crazy over this I hope now that we're partnered with Universal Studios that we have more things coming. Now, if you're a huge Christmas story fan, or um, what is it, the Christmas family vacation movie, I'm drawing a blank on what the actual name of it is, um, we have a warmer coming out, and a couple other different types of warmers coming out in those themes. As well as at the end of this month, we have our NFL collection coming out, and August 19th, our Beetlejuice. So stay tuned. If you like any of those Universal licensed products, let me know. And I'll get those ordered for you. 
but I have a feeling that Beetlejuice is definitely going to sell out, so don't wait on Beetlejuice. But thanks for tuning in, guys, and if you need any help with anything or have questions or if you want to try anything, let me know. I have tons of things in different samples, whether it's cleaning line, laundry line, waxes, anything, you name it. Um, and also, because we have a new fall catalog coming out in September, that means a lot of the stuff we have right now available in our summer and spring collection are 10% off, which is amazing. So stock up on all those summer stuff right now. Or put them in your Scentsy Club so you don't lose them. But if you need me to place an order or if you need to just sample something, let me know and I'll send that out to you.